guys, Tilly the Mompreneur here and welcome back to another vlog. So, yeah, I was cooking, ready to record and, you know, get show you guys what I was making and electricity decides to go. So I, I just got pissed off and then I stopped recording and then went on to bath and do other things. So right now I'm about to do work things because, yeah. We need to make that paper, you guys. So I've got someone coming in just now. And yeah, I'm just with Miss T. Say hello. Hello. Look here and say hello. Hello. Look at the camera. <laughs> you're taking off my things. I don't know why you're taking them off. I don't know why you're taking them off. So finally, finally, I'm using my bottle and I... It comes with stickers, so I personalized it with some um, stickers. Those are the ones that she's taking off. Wow! Wake up, today's gonna be a good day. 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 You see my setup, you guys. This is my setup and this is what we were plotting. We are finally done after how many hours? Seven or eight. From around ten, aren't it? Yeah. It's now around six. six. So this is what it's looking like. Amazing. Come and get your hair done by me. <laughs> We don't do my buns here. We plait properly. Properly. Oh my gosh. Here we go. This is what it's looking like. Hey. Slay, slay. <laughs> This is what it's looking like, you guys. Mm, mm. They are looking good. You like? <laughs> hey guys. So they bought these beautiful, beautiful bones from Food Lovers. If you didn't know, Food Lovers has tasty, tasty mabondo. And they cook easily, guys. I, one hour, and they cooked. And then I'm just making this um, stew, going to put the bones inside, and we're going to enjoy, enjoy, enjoy. Yeah, guys, today work was really fun. I always enjoy my clients, the one that came today, because, like, we vibe. You know, when you just have that kind of client who you vibe with, we really, really vibe. So I enjoyed my time, and it didn't seem as if it was long, although it was long. But, yeah. So now I'm just cooking supper. I am tired now. I'm tired, and I've got a headache. So I'm just cooking supper, and then we'll have our supper, and I'll just watch an episode of Nancy Drew and go and um and go and chill basically um yeah that's just what i'm up to hey guys good morning from this side of the world <laughs> so today um i've got i've got work going on around the house these what? Okay. So I've got work going on around the house. I've got some contractors who are around who are doing with the public. So wash your face. They're just washing their faces, the skulls, and brushing their teeth. So um, we have an issue with the plumbing, but that is what is being fixed. So, um, yeah, I'm just making them um, food. Do you guys do that? When you've got contractors around the house, do you buy them food or do you make for them food? Or do you supply them with food? Yeah, us, we just think it, it, it makes sense for people who are working to be able to eat. So 
instead of buying them like yeah but would have bought the food anyway so we buy them food and we just make them food and give them food so that is what i am doing right now abby would kill me if he knew i was busy recording instead of cooking so <laughs> let me get to cooking them i'm just making this with um with some salsa so let me hurry up do that and give them the food so i forgot to tell you so we've got um all our water that we are using currently in um in buckets and in containers um water to flush the toilet water basically water to do everything because we've closed um the main the mains for the water so yeah, they are operating from these bottles. So cooking, doing everything, we are just using this water. But hopefully it will be done in a few hours and we'll be able to go back to normal. So I just had to store water in these so this is how I cook my sides. I put the mealy meal first and then mix with a bit of um, cold water so that it becomes a paste. How do you cook your sides? I know some people put um, hot water direct. How do you cook your pap or your sada? How do you cook it? So after I've made like this, um, what's it called? The smooth paste then I put in the hot water and then let it boil yes Anna. with any pimples that's why I use the cold water method first in making a paste and then adding in the hot water it will be so so smooth you guys it will be so smooth can you see that bubbling <clears throat> this is what you want you want bubbles coming from different sides instead of the bubbles coming from just one place because when it's too thick the bubbles only come out on one spot so as you can see one two three right around the pot it is boiling so we close that let that do its magic um i leave it on for like um 10 minutes boils for like 10 minutes Then I harden it. <laughs> we call it kumona in Shona. So then I mona it and then it becomes, you know, that um, thick swallow. This is looking good, guys. This is looking amazing. I wanted to show you guys what I use. Okay. So I first use this one that looks like this so that it mixes the sada well and then I use the flat one. don't like mine thick thick but when you are making for men who are working a lot of them like thick sada as you 
can see it's not yet the consistency i want and the more you leave it on the stove the drier it gets or the harder it gets so your musica first or your whisk first and then go in with the flat one can you see how smooth it's looking no pimples at all at all at all yes and the water no, don't take out my hand. So we're just gonna let this simmer. But it is looking good. that's it. 